we're on the contest 55. Um, another beautiful boat. This is about 2.5 million euros for this boat as it sits. Clever little things I thought with the inbuilt uh, furling point for your code zero. They're all flush hatches, beautiful teak, really clean decks. Um, in mast furling and hydraulic boom as well. It looks pretty nice and then they've still got an adjustable backstay which I thought was interesting. Um, and flush hatches on the cabin top which quite a few people seem to cut that. These big windows that look amazing are all glass as well. Even the big curves in there are still <laughs> glass which I like over the acrylic. Um, I like the walk down into the cockpit. It's just a really nice cockpit shape. Looks super comfy and high backs and so on too, which is better than the Oyster, which had the lower backs, which I thought was great. And the main saloon, nav station. Oh, hang on, I can go to wide angle. Yeah, it's really nice thought this finish on the walls with the little grooves in there of what looks like real teak is cool. Road cabin, Pullman's cabin. The Pullman looks great too. It's a decent size bed at the bottom. Forward head. I think the teak great floors look fantastic, but I suspect you'd always be cleaning crap out from underneath them. The galley's really good sized galley. Nice little details like the finger hold here. Somehow it just feels really nice. And I like these sort of clicky buttons for the drawers and the drawers inside are all beach, which is beautiful. Great fridges. I think that's the, they're the fridges that we had on our boat. And they were very nice. Half cabin with the walk around. For some reason, everybody seems to, I don't know if you can see in here, but narrow it in at the feet, which Deb's not a fan of, and aft head. I think you can have a glass, not a shower curtain. That seems less than ideal. And then that's access to the engine room, but you obviously need a key to get in there. Uh, and washing machines in here. And it's a proper domestic machine. I think I said earlier this was about 2.5 mil uh, euro as the boat sits now. I think the list price is much less, like 1.7 or something, but he said this was about 